Welcome to the Windows Computer and Technology Channel. And, uh, well, one of the other things we learned today is that the big feature update coming up September 26th will also have included the Copilot. It will be out of beta testing and officially available and in included for Windows 11, for Microsoft Edge, and so on. And a host of other Microsoft products will all use Copilot AI. Uh, so this is uh, coming up. Going to be interesting to see when it is officially uh, installed and working. Uh, Copilot is, of course, what will replace Cortana. It is officially going to be a, um, you know, AI-driven, but um, it's, it's going to be interesting. Um, how people use or don't use it and see what it uh, actually does. Does it, is it better? Um, one thing for sure is all the demonstrations they've shown, it, it just looks like, you know, Bing chat AI that we had in Bing and the uh, edge browser and that is available if you want in also um, the Google Chrome browser now. Uh, so, you know, it is going to be more standalone, but still, I think it's, um, I don't know, it's, it's, I, I, if you haven't used Cortana, you've never used Cortana, you won't hear, you won't use Copilot. Uh, will it be an app that you can uninstall or will it be just there? I don't know, but um, anyways, coming September the 26th, at the same time as we'll get a host of new features that we'll talk about, of course, next week. We'll have a big week in videos because we'll have all of the features. We're going to talk about what the new features are all about. Uh, and uh, one of the things that they were saying and they were showing with Copilot is that uh, if you have a stylus and you write on your screen, uh, you can actually write a math equation on your screen and Copilot can, will actually understand the writing and actually solve that equation for you. So looks powerful enough and interesting. But we'll see what comes out of this uh, eventually. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.